Nicole Scott here for Netbook News, and here we have the Koopa X11 Windows 8 Developer Edition build. So this actually runs a Windows 7 Professional, but I've loaded Windows 8 on it. And right now we're going to be taking a quick look at how you set up your picture password. So it's here in the control panel, create a picture password. I'll just enter my password. This is a Koopa tablet, so I thought I'd make the password that. So let's choose a picture. Uh, it's selecting one album cover that I have loaded on the tablet here. So I'll use this picture. So now I can do straight lines, circles, and taps. So why don't I start with a straight line? And then I'll do a circle. And I'll do a tap. It's so nice to do a straight line, circle, tap. Hmm, it didn't quite match. So straight line, oh, circle. Wow, I've already forgotten. And tap. <laughs> so let's try it again. Straight line, circle, and tap. All right, so now I've success succeeded. Now, for everybody who kind of says, well, it's very easy to identify photos, it's true. But, I mean, how often do you, how identifiable is this? I mean, seriously, I was able to identify somebody's login across the, across the room. So, yeah, so I mean... Yeah, you can identify it by picture, but I mean, all the other graphics logins as well offer the same kind of issues. So, I do like the picture password protect. Now, we'll uh, restart the computer here, and let's see if I can actually remember what the picture password login is this time. Uh, but how I've liked Windows 8 so far, I've, I've really liked it. Um, I think that the way that you flip between so let's see if I remember. One, two, three. All right, so I was able to log in. I mean, this is slightly larger than what we're seeing on the Android phone, but I mean, it's still an interesting way to log in. Now, one of the, one of the features that I like the most about um, this tab is obviously the refreshing tiles is nice, but I think that this is gonna be a killer feature here. When I can, I can go to my desktop, so it brings up a traditional Windows 7 desktop. And all I have to do is hit the Start button here to bring it back. Pull from the side. And I can hit back and forth. So I really think that Windows 8 tablet shouldn't be underestimated from what I'm seeing here. Uh, it's, it's pretty interactive. And I thought I'd give you a quick look at setting up your picture password. So this has been Nicole Scott for Netbook News, taking a look at Windows 8.